Didn't work as well as I'd hoped. This is not balanced well. Hi. This is a weird. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Basically, I wanted to talk for a very, very short amount of time about uh, Easy A. I think this might be the only clip in the vlog this week. Not good. However, I want to talk about the movie Easy A. I watched it for the first time ever the other day. It's on Netflix and it's pretty good. My mom and my dad watched it at one point, I believe, uh, when it came out. Point is, I, I couldn't watch it because I was, you know, like 10 or 11 when they watched it. So they were like, uh, no, because, you know, it's all about sex and stuff. So I watched it for the first time, um, being a fan of Emma Stone, uh, particularly because of her performance in, uh, the Amazing Spider-Man and Zombieland, like, you know, numerous other things that she also happens to be in. Point is, um, I was interested, I was intrigued in the movie, um, because I knew it was a comedy and I knew it was sex related, but I totally forgot the whole Scarlet Letter tie-in reference thing that they did, which was very interesting. And, um, Honestly, the movie was a very, I wouldn't say it's insightful, but a very colored look at sexuality, especially in high school, even though no one looks like high schoolers in the movie. And it's very, it ends up coming across to to be a, quite an endearing movie. Um, the end is a little like, quick, quick, we get in the movie. But the rest of it, it's really well paced. The comedy is pretty good. It's fairly funny um it's definitely like a late 2000s early 2010s movie and i love that feeling that those era of movies um honestly from like 2005 onward i love that that era a lot um probably like a seven out of ten on my scale um not not like a six because uh, like a six is where i start to go eh, i don't know if i'd ever watch it again seven I think it's probably right where it's at. Um, I would watch it again. Um, I'm not like begging to watch it again, but it, was, it wasn't bad. Um, so if you're in the, if you're in the market for a kind of like teen, young adult, you know, raunchy comedy movie, Easy A might be an option for you. It is on Netflix currently. And if you like Emma Stone, it's her breakout role. Um, it was the role that kind of put her on the map, and rightfully so. She's very funny. And there's also some other really interesting characters in it, um, and really interesting actors in it, like Lisa Kudrow from Friends. Um, she's in there. It could have had a little more artistic flair to it, but in no way does that make it bad or, or take away from the movie. It just wasn't um, overly... wasn't overly special. Uh, other than that, I don't, I don't know, this is a weird, I'm filming this on a Wednesday morning um, for the week before vlog because I wanted to talk about Easy A because I watched it last week. My Halo Infinite statue is coming, so you'll see that in next week's vlog. Oh, and I wanted to talk about Extra Life. Yeah, so I did Extra Life this last weekend um, uh, on Saturday. So that, that was the actual game day. I did it from noon until 3 a.m., which was grueling. It was very long. It's 15 hours. It actually went really, really well. Uh, I was so surprised about how well it went, for the most part, anyway. Um, Brooke was comically late. Um, in fact, it was like 11 and 59. Seth and Jeff were both in the Discord call with me, um, ready to play Fall Guys. And I was like, Brooke hasn't texted me or been on yet. I'm calling 1.30. She'll wake up, she'll get on, it'll be 1.30. I fucking nailed it. Like, 1.10, she texts me. Hey, I just woke up, I'll be on, I have to go to the bathroom and stuff. 1.30, she gets on. Fucking nailed it. That was funny. 
because we got to, you know, hang out and play Fall Guys for a couple hours, and then we did so much other stuff. We did, like, Apex Legends, which was really fun. Um, Christian was there for a bit of Apex. Unfortunately, you know, uh, his internet didn't work super well, so he was lagging a lot. Um, Nicholas, my brother, my brother Nicholas was there. He hung out for two hours during Apex from 9 to 11 p.m. That was a lot of fun. Uh, we did Battlefield 4, which Cole was supposed to be there for, but unfortunately he had to go do homework stuff. Um, but he was hanging out in, in the call for a while um, before then. So Christian and Seth and I played um, Battlefield. We also played Overwatch. Overwatch was really fun. Um, that was all of us, all six of us. So um, me, Christian, Jeff, Seth, Cole, and Brooke, uh, we all played Overwatch. That was super fun, having a full full team, a full six people, um, being able to delegate roles was really fun. <laughs> and after Christian left, things went downhill. We started fighting a lot, but it ended up being really funny for the stream, personally, I think. It was just a, like a really fun romp. Um, I ended the stream, just me and Jeff. Brooke got off like 10 minutes before the end because she was so tired. Um, and then Jeff ended the stream with me. It was super great. Jeff was there basically the entire time. Brooke was there basically the entire time. Um, Seth was there as long as he could. He was exhausted by the end. Um, there was a while where it was just me and Seth playing Battlefield for a bit. And it was just constant yawning. It was so bad. Oh God. So, and then on top of the actual playing games and, and the entertainment factor of it, we did raise um, a good chunk of change. By the end of the stream, we got $300 up from 120, so we got $180 donated. Uh, another 100 was from my mother, um, but 80 of it was from um, Christian and Seth and Logan um, and some other donations in there. So we're at 425 now. So. $95 away from the one chip challenge, which hey, if you want to if you want to donate um, I'll try to remember when editing this and uploading this put the link down below if you do want to donate Donations are open until the end of the year um, Until I think December 29th is when they end them 2020 you can feel free to check that out uh, if we hit $420 um, I will do the one chip challenge probably with Seth and Christian. They both seemed like they were into it, so we'll see. That could be something really dumb that we do. Um, maybe I can get Brooke to try a little bit of it too, if she happens to be up here when we can film that. Anyways, um, uh, that's everything I wanted to say. You know, if you want to donate to Extra Life, you know, play games, heal kids, donate to that children's hospital. Um, that link is down below if you would like, and it's greatly appreciated. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go now. Hope you uh, are having a good day. Uh, I'll see you whenever this vlog picks up next. I don't know. Hey everyone, this is a weird vlog. Uh, I edited it really fast, I'll be honest. I didn't put a whole lot of work into it. I'm very preoccupied. I've been streaming a lot and um, it's wearing me out, honestly. Um, and I'm watching Daredevil to relax and I'm having a hard time putting it down. Uh, so this vlog was very rushed. I I'm sorry, but I I'm also not. Um, sometimes I need to take a little me time because I've been working a lot the past about two and a half weeks. I haven't had a day off. So anyways, uh, week 75 total is pretty simple. 2,712 minutes and 45 hours, 12 minutes. That's that's the total, 45 hours, 12 minutes. Um, honestly, I only streamed five out of seven days that week, um, but the, that 15 hour extra live stream really put a lot of time in. Like I said, that's linked down below if you do wanna donate. That is something that uh, I would very much appreciate and I'm sure the sick children who get help, who get equipment, whose families, their, their treatment gets paid for if they can't afford it would very much appreciate that. You can also feel free to check out my Twitch link. I do stream there basically every day of the week uh, at 9 p.m. Eastern time. Link down below, twitch.tv slash theskullhq. You can also feel free to subscribe here because I do host a vlog once a week, begrudgingly sometimes, like today. But um, I hope it was still a pleasant little 
conversation, and I hope that you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, feel free to like the video if you liked it. Favorite the video, favorite the video if it was your favorite, and uh, subscribe for more. I will see you later. Take care.